Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, hi, my name is Maria. I do all kinds of videos on cooking, cleaning, organizing, and yes, we are organizing the fridge today, but not just the fridge. We're also gonna organize the freezer, which I have never organized before. My fridge is currently somewhat organized, but the system I have right now isn't working for us. And as you can see here, my fridge is a little bit messy and to me, I feel it's important to have an organized fridge because I feel it minimizes food waste and when you know what you have in your fridge, you know what you need to buy at a grocery store. Sometimes I come home and I buy something that I already have, like broccoli and it's just hidden somewhere. Even though, you know, veggies go in the veggie drawer, fruits go in the fruit drawer, however, everything gets mixed up and then, um, yeah, so I need to reorganize this and I want everything to have its own place so then I know exactly where something is. So the first step to have an organized fridge is to take everything out and I mean everything and I have this cool little cooler that I got at Costco is amazing. I have it in my car but I'm going to use this to put to store things while I'm cleaning out the fridge because I just don't want it to go bad. And since you're taking everything out of the fridge, this is the perfect time to declutter it. So going through all the expiration dates and just to see if something is going bad and just get rid of it. And it will be so much nicer and cleaner because your fridge will be decluttered. And since you already have everything out of the fridge, this is the perfect time to give it a little scrub because it probably needs it. And even though I cleaned my fridge not too long ago, it's still so dirty and I had to literally scrub it from head to toe again. I'm also gonna wash the fruit and veggie bin because it was, it was already so dirty and I don't know when I'm gonna wash it next time. And um, after I gave it a nice scrub, I'm just gonna wipe it down so it's nice and shiny and clean and then I can start putting things back in the fridge. And now that everything is clean and shiny, I'm gonna place some bins in the fridge just to see how it's gonna look before starting to put the produce and the veggies in them or whatever item I'm thinking of doing. I'm just kinda of trying to figure out and have a layout that I'm gonna be happy with. And I did invest in some bins and I know they can be kinda of expensive, but I feel it's like a lifetime investment. You're always gonna use it. And if not in the fridge, I can you can totally like reuse it somewhere else. So, but they help so much to keep things organized. My life before bins was hectic and crazy. So thank you, bins. <laughs> but um, and that's a lazy Susan up there. I always had it there. If you did not have a lazy Susan in your fridge, I recommend to try it because you're gonna love it. You can fit a lot more things, and it's just so great that you can spin it and just choose whatever you want. Anyways, once I like my layout and I know where things are going to go, I'm gonna just start putting everything back in the fridge. And I like to keep my milk and all of my beverages on the shelf over here because I just feel that it keeps everything much cooler. Like once it's all the way in the fridge, the warm air doesn't circulate as much. So that's why I just put it up there.
I always make sure to dedicate a bin to miscellaneous things, something that I don't always keep in my fridge, but I tend to have it and I don't know where to put it. So a miscellaneous bin is so important for me, but I don't know, maybe you guys always cook the same food, but we don't. And I feel that it helps keep it more organized because if you don't know where to put something, you're just gonna stick it somewhere. But then if you have a miscellaneous bin, you know where to put it in there. I just wanna make sure that I don't have it overflowing, but it is totally helpful. And if you guys can, try to dedicate a space for leftovers because I know that we can make our fridge super nice by just stacking it with bins all over. It might look pretty, but then if you don't have room for leftovers, where are you gonna put them? So I tried to use not as many bins, but a space for leftovers and it has helped us tremendously because now we are not afraid of having leftover food because we know we, we can put it in the fridge. Last, I'm gonna wash my fruit, like strawberries, grapes. I should have done that in the beginning so then they would have dried by now, but I don't think that far ahead. So um, I wash them, I let them dry, and then I do add a little bit of vinegar to my fruits and veggies because it helps to get rid of all the nasty stuff that's on them. And now that I'm done with my fridge, I'm moving on to my freezer. And as you can see, it's a hot mess. I don't even know what I have, which is unfortunately a lot of us, I think. Um, but it's really important to know what you have in your freezer because you might have it and you think you don't have it. So organize your freezer as well. So here I'm just going to clean it as well, just as I did with the fridge because it needs a good wash as well. And then I'm gonna start, you know, putting things back and obviously gonna go through my inventory to make sure I don't have anything expired. And I actually bought amazing bins that I'll show you in a bit that I got off Amazon. Um, they're like for filing paperwork or something, but they actually work so great in the freezer. And I, to this day, I just, I admire it because everything is so organized still. So this is the layout that I chose to have in my freezer. This is the top portion. So these file bins are complete game changer in my freezer. As you can see, I have four of them and I'm just putting each category that I decided to have and keeping it in there. And it's so easy, you just grab or you throw it in there and you can literally see what you have. And you're using more of the vertical space, which I've never done that in the past. So now I can fit more and still see what I have. Anyways, I will have everything linked for you guys if you are interested, but I, absolutely recommend them. We want our lives to be like a dream. So this is how everything looks and I am so happy because everything is so organized, especially the freezer. So if you guys enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel, and I will see you next time. Bye guys. Security.